If you can, please print out a PDF file on the description below so you can work with me. First one, 8 minus 3.7. So 8 is the same as 8.0. So I just write 3.7 underneath. So now I just take away from there. Because 0 cannot take away 7, so I borrow 1 from 8, so it becomes 7. And it becomes 10. 10 minus 7 is 3. And I put a dot down. 7 minus 3 is 4. So the answer is 4.3. Second one, 48.4 minus 19.7. So we just write 48.4 minus 19.7. So 4 take away 7. So 4 cannot take away 7. So we borrow 1 from 8. So the 8 becomes 7. And 4 become 14. Now 14 take away 7. So you can use 10 take away 7 is 3 at 4 is 7. Otherwise, you can use your finger to help you to do the minus. So you go start from 7, you count up all the way to 14. At the moment, I just do tally, okay? So we start from 7, you go up to 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. So that is 7. And then the decimal point, we write that down first. And 7 take away 9. So we cannot do that. So we borrow 1 from 4. So 4 becomes 3. And the 7 becomes 17. 17 take away 9. 10 take away 9 is 1. And 7 is 8. Otherwise, you can just start from 9. Use your finger. Count up all the way to 17. So let's, let's do it. So 9, you go 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17. So the answer is 8. And then next one is 3 take away 1, which is 2. So the answer is 28.7. Number 3. 23.65 minus 18.7. So I just write this down first. So 28.65 minus 18.7. So make sure the place value are matched because otherwise it would be wrong. So 18. So I write underneath of this and then 0 0.7. Don't forget the easy way to match this is if you're not sure the decimal point must be underneath of each other. Then the place value will be the same. So 7, so 18.7 is exactly the same as 18.70. So now I just minus as per normal. 5 take away 0, the answer is 5. 6 cannot take away 7, so you borrow 1 from 8, so the 8 becomes 7. 6 becomes 16. So 16 take away 7, 10 take away 7 is 3, at 6 is 9. Otherwise, you start from 7, use your finger, count up all the way to 16. So like 7, we start from 7, we go 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. There you go, so it's 9. And then the decimal point, we write it down first, okay? 7 take away 8, of course, you cannot do that. So we can borrow 1 from 2, so the 2 become 1, and 7 becomes 17. 17 take away 8. So 10 take away a 2 at 7 is 9. Otherwise, you go 8 or go up all the way to 17 with the help of your fingers. So we start from 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So it's 9. See, there you go. So we add 9. And then 1 take 1 is 0. So 9 point. 9.5. So I just write equal here. 9.95. Fourth one. 45.65. Take away 12.4. Take away 19. So the easiest way is we just do the one at a time. So we do from left to right. Okay. Because they all take away. So 45.65 minus 
12.4. Make sure the place value are correct, okay? So the, the decimal point right underneath of each other. So 10 place value and then must be matched with 10 and then units, matched with unit and so on. So 12.4 is exactly the same as 12.40. 12 so 5 take away 0 is 5. Uh, 6 take away 4 is 2. And the decimal point, we just write this down. 5 take away 2 is 3. And then 4 take away 1 is 3. So the answer is 33.25. Then this is done. Then that minus 19. So what I do, I just write here. So 33.25 minus 19. So make sure the place value is correct. So 19 is exactly the same as 19.00. So I write 19.00. And then I just minus, minusing it. 5 take away 0 is 5. 2 take away 0 is 2. And the dot, of course, we write it down. 3 cannot take away 9. So we borrow 1 from 3. So this becomes 2. And then this becomes 13. Now 13 take away 9. 10 take away 9 is 1. At 3 is 4. Otherwise, you start from 9. You go all the way up to 13. Use, use your fingers. So you go 9. 10, 11, 12, 13. So it's 4. So write it down. And then 2 take away 1 is 1. So the answer is 14.25. Please stop the video and try this one yourself. First one, 19 minus 12.6. So remember 19 is the same as 19.0. And then minus 12.6. So 0 cannot take away 6. We borrow the 1 from 9. So we cross out the 9. It becomes 8. And it becomes 10. So 10 minus 6 is 4. Okay. If you cannot do it in your mind, you can always use your finger. You start from 6, you count all the way up to 10. So 6, you go 7, 8, 9, 10. So it's 4. And then 8, take away 2. Of course, before we do that, we write down the decimal point first. Very important. So 8, take away 2 is 6. So you start from 2, you go 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's 6. So you write this down. And 1 minus 1 is 0. So that is... 6.4 Next one 48.3 minus 27.7 So just write 48.3 minus 27.7 So now 3 cannot take away 7 So you cross You borrow 1 from 8 So that give me 7 That give me 13 10 take away 7 Is 3 so you add 3 is 6. So put a dot down. And then 7 minus 7 is 0. And then 4 minus, 4 minus 2, the answer is 2. So which is equal to 20.6. Question number 3. 34.65. Minus 18.17. So I just write this down. 34.65 minus 18.17. So now 5 cannot take away 7. So you borrow 1 from 6. So that give me 5. That give me 1. So 15. 10 take away 7. Okay. Is 3 at 5 is 8. Otherwise, you start from 7, go all the way up to 15 You by using your fingers. So you go 8, start from 7, you go 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There you go, it's 8. And then now, 5 take away 1 is 4, you write that down. And the decimal point, of course, you write this down first. And 4 cannot take away 8, so you borrow 1 from 3, so the 3 becomes 2, 
and this becomes 14. 10 take away 8 is 2, add 4 is 6. And then 2 take away 1 is 1. So the answer is 16.48. Last question. So, 125.35 minus 42.9 and minus 59. So we're going to start from left to right, okay? So, I just write this down. 125.35, you take away 42.9 and then put a zero down. And then that's it. 5 take away zero is 5. And then 3 cannot take away 9, so we borrow 1 from 5, so cross that out, give me 4, and 3 become 13. So 13 take away 9, so 10 take away 9 is 1, at 3 is 4. Otherwise, start from 9, use your finger, count up all the way to 13. So you got 9, you got 10, 11, 12, 13, see, it's 4. And the decimal point, we write it down. 4 take away 2, so 2, you start from 2, 3, 4, so it's 2. There you go. And then 2 cannot take away 4. We borrow 1 from the 1, so that becomes 0. 2 becomes 12. 12 take away 4. 10 take away 4 is 6, and 2 is 8. Again, you can always use your finger. You count up all the way to 12, start from 4. So you got to start from 4. You go 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, So which is 8. So now this is done. What we need to do is we minus 59 from 82.45. So I just write 82.45 minus 59. Remember 59, 59 is the same as 59.00. So therefore I just write this down first, 59.00. And then 5 minus 0 is 5. So I just write this down. 4 minus 0 is 4. And this decimal point, of course, I write this down. 2 cannot minus 9. So we borrow 1 from 8. So this becomes 7. And 2 becomes 12. So 12 minus 9. So 10 minus 9 is 1. At 2 is 3. And then 7 minus 5 is 2. So the answer is 23.45. Thank you so much for watching.